she refused to take my dollar to give me 30 cents after I paid it for extra cheese. Comes down to a 30 cent piece of cheese. A Dayton area police officer is facing assault charges after video caught him punching a woman in the face several times at McDonald's. And this is after the woman again became upset when she didn't get a slice of cheese on her Big Mac. Now that officer is being represented now by a prominent Cincinnati defense attorney. Mike Shell is live downtown with the very latest on this. Mike, a 30 cent slice of cheese? That's what it comes down to, Trisha. Uh, we are outside the office of Stu Matthews, who in 2015 successfully defended former UC police officer Ray Tenzing, who was accused of killing Sam DeBose during a traffic stop. Matthews says that Butler Township Police Sergeant Todd Stanley followed proper procedure when the woman became belligerent and wouldn't follow his commands. The altercation was filmed by a customer inside the McDonald's restaurant on January 16th. Attorney Stu Matthews says his client, Sergeant Stanley, and another officer approached Otinka Hancock to get her information because the restaurant wanted to cite her for trespassing. And she got an attitude because I asked her for a refund and called the police because she didn't want to give me back my money. This is a very incredibly sad day when Miss Latika Hancock's life has been upended over a piece of cheese. Can I get a driver's license number or something from you or name no, and date of birth? I don't have one. Well, I'm going to issue a trespass notice and I have to fill out a piece of paper. I okay? can care less. Okay, what you're I just do. need some information. No. He told her multiple times, all I'm going to do is give you a piece of paper and you're on your way. Um, but she continued to be irate and wouldn't provide the information. We have to serve That's you with a criminal will. trespass notice. No, you don't. Yes, by law, no, we do. You just want okay, to then we're going to arrest you. Call. Then we're going to arrest no, you. No, you're not. To identify. No, you're then not. Then identify yourself. No. Yes. For what? Over I, a sandwich? She became irate and she said her name was Hancock and spelled no, okay. Hancock, no, but no, wouldn't no, give him any further no, information. No, behind your back. No, I'm not. You are under arrest for failure to identify. Don't put your hands. Okay, my last behind, name is Hancock. Put, I already told you that. Behind your back. No. I don't want Put to, your hands. I'm telling you. Okay, I'm saying okay. Put your hands behind your back. You're going to get tased. Okay. And that is when Sergeant Stanley struck Latinka Hancock in the face. And the policies and procedures of the Butler Township Police Department allows that type of strike in order to try to get somebody un under control. You hit me repeatedly in the face. I just want to go home at this point. It's not worth it over a sandwich. Attorney Michael Wright said McDonald's should be ashamed for calling the police over an order that they got wrong. If they can't manage basic customer service and now opting to potentially put a person's life in jeopardy over a mishandled Big Mac, it doesn't seem safe right, for black people to go and eat at McDonald's anymore. Now, the McDonald's franchise in Butler Township referred us to the Corporate Communications Department for comment. We have not heard back. Ohio BCI has filed misdemeanor assault charges against Sergeant Stanley, who pleaded not guilty during his arraignment last week. He remains on paid administrative leave until the court process plays out. Reporting live downtown, Mike Shell, Fox 19 Now. Thank you, Mike Shell.